everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here for the first time, welcome. My name's Trina Louise, and over here on this channel, we do all things plus size fashion and beauty. Today, we have another advent calendar unboxing for you. They are coming in quite quickly at the moment. This is the fourth one that I've done for you. I've done Look Fantastic. I've done the 24 day ASOS one and the 12 day ASOS one. I'll link all of those down below. But today's advent calendar is special guys. This is so special. This advent calendar needs batteries. That is how extra this advent calendar is. So this is the Deluxe 3D calendar from Rituals. This costs £89.90 and inside you get 24 amazing goodies. Rituals is a beautiful brand. I think they're most known for their body care products like their shower foams, their shower oils, products that you use to pamper yourself in the bathroom. I am so excited for this calendar guys. I cannot explain to you how excited I am. This is what the calendar looks like when you get it. You have a little sleeve here that you can pop off and then it's got a gorgeous ribbon on it and a little tag so you can write someone's name on it if it's a gift this is <laughs> this is huge guys this is huge so I think we should open this up so you can see what is inside and why we need <laughs> batteries to make this advent calendar so let's slip off the bow you don't want to unwrap something when it's this beautiful. <laughs> I'm going to lay it down but the top just comes off and as you can see <laughs> we need to put this advent calendar together. So I'm going to insert a little clip now of me putting it together for you. Wait till you see, if you haven't seen this calendar yet guys, wait until you see just how beautiful it is. what the actual advent calendar looks like. Now, before I talk about the process of putting it together, it does look beautiful, I'm not gonna lie, but putting it together was stressful. I kind of feel like, I'd, you'll have to let me know in the comments down below, I kind of wish the lights were already taped on for the amount of money that this cost because sticking the lights on was quite difficult because it shows you where you're meant to put the sticker and where the light is meant to go, but the lights on the string don't quite align, so it was quite tricky. And also getting the plastic stickers off. You know when you're trying to peel stickers and it peels the back? That kept happening, so thankfully there was a couple of spares. But I found the only way I could do it was to like scrape my nail across and get the <laughs> sticker off. So that was quite stressful. Um, you can't quite see it now because of all my lights, but I turned my lights down in the clips. So you can see that the light kind of peeks through the little windows, which is really cute. It doesn't show through all of them. So it is a little bit gimmicky, but it is really cute. And it does look amazing. Like, look at this. It is the most beautiful looking calendar ever. So let's get to the main event and look at what's in door number one. I love the mixture of the houses and the trees. It's so cute. So this is door number one and it tells you on the bottom what each of the products are. So I'm going to try and not <laughs> spoil it for myself. So let's have a look at door number one. So in door number one, we have a candle from the Savage Garden Private Collection. And it's just a really simple candle in a gorgeous glass pot. Like this is really simple and pretty. It smells of it does smell of a sort of herbal garden, that kind of thing. I'm not the best at describing scents, so you'll have to bear with me. But that's nice, and it just looks really, really sleek, simple, and sophisticated. On to door number two. 
So you can see how they just <laughs> pop out, trying to avoid the spoilers of what's inside. Let's see. Yay. <laughs> we have got the Rituals Tulip and Jasmine Yuzu Foaming Shower Gel, and this is from the Amsterdam collection. How stunning is this packaging? It is gorgeous. I love, I think I said in my glossy box calendar, I love foaming shower gels. They're my favorite shower gels of all times. So I'm over the moon to have this. This is a 50 mil, so a smaller size, but you need the tiniest little pump of this and it foams up and it is beautiful. I just feel like I'm having a pampered shower every time. And this packaging is stunning. So very excited. Can we smell it without? Not too much, but I don't want to squeeze it out because it goes everywhere. But the faint smell I can smell is really nice, but I'm obsessed with this packaging. So very happy with this door. Door number three three is this little one down here we have got the rituals of holly and it is the white lily and peach blossom and this is a happying body mist spring love it says this packaging again i'm obsessed with the packaging we're gonna have to give this a smell oh i love that oh my goodness yeah it's the peach. I love fruity smells, especially citrus smells, but I love fruity smells in general. That is gorgeous, gorgeous. So I'm definitely gonna use this. And this will be really good, like if you're going on a night out and you don't wanna take a big spray with you, you can just pop this in your little clutch or something and have it to refresh you on the night out. So this is absolutely gorgeous. Door number four, where are you? Door number four. So this feels like a heavy one. We have got, oh wow, this comes in lots of different little parts. This comes from the Rituals of Gin collection and it is a reed diffuser. So you just pop off the lid, pop on the wood and then put the sticks in and the fragrance will fill the room and these last for ages. We're gonna have to give this a sniff. It's not a very strong scent but it smells quite nice. So this is gonna be gorgeous in your bathroom and this really deep like tree green is stunning. This is a really nice product. I am so impressed. So you'd probably just peel off this sticker, make it look pretty, and then that is gonna look stunning in your bathroom. So on to door number five. It is a bit tricky trying to find the doors on here, but door number five is here at the back. What do we have? We have the Rituals of Sakura Recovery Hand Balm for dry skin and we get 70 mils. That's a really good size and it's cherry blossom and rice milk. I love this scent. I've got a couple of products in this scent already. I've got the body scrub, which we got in the Look Fantastic calendar and I've got a foaming um, shower gel in this scent and it is absolutely gorgeous. Let's give this a go. Oh, so nice, so nice. Oh, that feels gorgeous. But it doesn't feel too heavy. You know when you use a hand cream and you just like, for ages, because you can feel it on your skin, that has just soaked in beautifully. Mm. I love that scent. And the packaging as well, it is just so, so nice. Oh, love this door. Door number six. We've got another candle. So this is from the private collection again, but this is the green cardamom scent. This smells herbly. <laughs> Obviously, cardamom is a cooking <laughs> spice, herb, herb, herby. It's in the same sort of white packaging, which is really nice. I do know that there's a couple of these in here to help you celebrate the Sundays of Advent, which I think is quite a nice touch if you like candles anyway. Yeah, I think I prefer the first one, but this is still nice. So let's see what we've got in door number seven. Oh wow, this packaging is amazing. This is from the Ritual of Karma, and this is the Holy Lotus and Organic White Tea Body Cream. This packaging, the blue is stunning, absolutely stunning. Oh my goodness, so this is a body cream and you get 100 mils, so a really good size. Let's pop this on my other hand so I can smell it. It's a really thick body cream, so I think it's gonna be really moisturizing. That's nice. I can smell the tea. And then there's a sweet scent coming through. <laughs> it's a good thing that I don't like do perfume hauls or anything, we'd be in so much trouble. 
but that feels really nice and moisturizing and I'm obsessed with this packaging. And something to point out with the boxes is they've all got little messages on. So this one says, Christmas magic, do good and good will come your way with this body cream from the Rituals of Karma, which is so nice. Like every day on Christmas, you can wake up, read a beautifully positive, lovely message and get an amazing product to pamper yourself with. I'm enjoying this. This is a just, it's this calendar is an experience. That's what it is. Door number eight. That is the fastest I have found a door so far. Inside door number eight, we've got another foaming shower gel. This is the Rituals of Samurai, and this is organic bamboo and sandalwood. So this is probably a bit more of a masculine scent. Can't smell it too much, but I really like the sleek black packaging. And I, like I said, I get through these. I'm more than happy to have many, many, many multiples of the fat, the shower foam because I absolutely love it. But this is our first duplicate product. Well, no, the candle was a duplicate too, but a different scent and I'm happy with it. Door number nine. What is this? So this is the Parfum D'Interior. <laughs> and it's an interior perfume in sweet orange and cedarwood. I love anything citrus smelling, so this is perfect for me. So this is a interior perfume. I think you just spray the room or spray your furniture with it, I think. Don't take my word on that. Um, but in here we get 50 mils. So we're gonna have to give this a smell, aren't we? Let's see, let's spray the interior. I think the cedar wood is maybe overpowering the orange a little bit. It's quite intense when you sniff it like that, but it's meant to be like dispersed across the room. That's nice. That's something quite different. It is a little bit small, I'm not gonna lie, and I've got it in my mouth. <laughs> um, but I like that there's something different and individual in here to try. I've got that in my mouth. <laughs> Should teach me for like smelling an interior spray like in my face. <laughs> Door number 10. Oh, we've got a product from the Elixir collection and this is the Overnight Hydrating Hair Mask and it's got argan oil and, ooh, shikakai, I think something like that. That sounds amazing. I love masks for the hair, but I've never had a specific one that's overnight. I've had ones where you can use it overnight if you prefer, but this is specifically for overnight. Let's smell. We are gonna have sensual overload. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's a bit more runny than I expected, so be aware of that. It smells nice. Just gonna, it, we could just put like clips on repeat of me being like, this smells nice, this smells nice. Cause I don't know how to describe scents, but it is argan oil and shikakai. Sorry for my awful pronunciations, but we get 20 mils in here. So for, for me, I get a couple of uses out of this. So it gives me a really good chance to know if I like this product. Door number 11. We have got the Rituals of Hammam, and this is a black soap with refreshing eucalyptus and olive oil. What? Is this a soap? It's an ultra hydrating black soap with pure olive oil that's gonna nourish your skin and give you a silky softness. The eucalyptus has a deep cleansing and refreshing effect. What? It leaves the skin prepared for exfoliation. What? <laughs> We've got 70 mils in here. A black soap? What? <laughs> We're gonna have to have a look at this. Oh my goodness, it is, it is black. Wow. I don't know why I'm like, rubbing it into the skin it's soap oh that smells um yeah you, you i was gonna say a bit minty it's the eucalyptus that you can smell that is gonna be amazing at waking you up in the morning when you're a bit tired on that cold winter's morning and you want to get in the shower and refresh yourself and wake yourself up that's very different i'm very excited to try this on to door number 12 I'm having so much fun with this calendar. <laughs> it's just so individual and fun. So inside this door, we have got a scrubbing glove. So you pop this on your hand and then you scrub away and exfoliate, except I have quite big hands and, oh, am I gonna, this is a squeeze guys, this is a squeeze. Oh, and she's putting it on the wrong way. Wow, let's try again. Oh. It does stretch, you do get there. Mine has a little hole in, which is unfortunate. Um, but yeah, you just pop it on your hand when you can eventually get your fingers in. 
ignoring the hole and then you just scrub your body with this and have an exfoliating session it doesn't feel too rough i am not the biggest fan of a product like this to be honest i think i just don't usually put the time in to do this extra kind of step and it is a little bit poor quality unfortunately so not my favorite door but i know some people will really enjoy this but yeah probably not for me Door number 13 is a little one. I think this is another candle. It is, but this is in a different black packaging. This is the Wild Fig candle and it has got a black wax as well. Very faint scents, but I find with candles, you can't really tell how strongly scented they are till you start burning them. I bought one the other day and I was like, this smells like nothing and I burnt it and it's the strongest scented candle I've ever smelled. So it's hard to judge. But I do like that we're getting, if we're getting four candles, I do like that we're getting four different scents, hopefully. We haven't had the fourth yet. Number 14, and we've got our first Christmas tree. <laughs> so what do we have inside our tree? We have got the Rituals of Namaste Glow Anti-Aging Ampule Booster. I have no idea what this is. Let's have a look. Oh, okay uh not very clear what it is yet i guess it's some kind of serum or something but it's one of these where you like break off the glass and you pop it on your skin i'm gonna have to look this one up oh it's got an instruction inside thank you rituals for thinking of people like me who have no idea what this is so you use this before bed to help firm and hydrate tired looking skin to add hydration and radiance after cleansing apply the um, so, um, 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 pool to your skin that's whatever this container is called I think or the product I'm not sure um, but apply it to your skin after cleansing use as a seven day cure treatment for optimal results serum and night cream can be applied afterwards I'm not impressed with this I'm guessing this is an expensive product but the fact that they say you should use seven days of this treatment to get the best effect probably should have put seven days in like I guess this gives you a good tester but I don't know you'll have to let me know down below I'm kind of disappointed by just getting one of these but I have never tried anything like this before and I'm very intrigued to try it day 15 it's another Christmas tree this one feels a bit heavier so hopefully it's not another glass capsule no we have got a mini shower gel this is the rituals of karma and this is again the holy lotus and organic white tea and this is a shower gel and we've got 30 mils so we'll get a couple of uses out of this oh, i'm not sure how impressed i am with the sizes of some of these products again it smells really really nice but i just i don't know like i just feel like the products could have been a little bit bigger with some of them but still excited to try it love the packaging i'm obsessed with the packaging of rituals products but you know could have been a little bit bigger day 16 over here we have got a balancing body cream from the rituals of i ayurveda ayurveda I'm sorry for the pronunciation and this is an Indian rose and Himalayan honey. I'm not the biggest rose scented fan but I love honey so we're gonna have to give this a go. We've got 70 mils in here so a reasonable size. Oh oh I can't smell the rose. That smells so sweet and it feels amazing. This is the this is my favorite cream so far. This feels the nicest on my skin. It genuinely feels silky smooth yeah after a shower this is gonna be gorgeous yeah this is my favorite body product so far i love this scent indian rose and himalayan himalaya honey oh love it door 17. so we've got a another body mist and this is the rituals of karma which is the holy lotus and organic white tea and this is another 20 mils let's have another spray we are gonna be smelling of all the smells <laughs> nice it's a bit of a lighter scent actually so not too overpowering so if you prefer a lighter scent this might be for you yeah really nice and again a duplicate product but it is a different scent i expected a couple of duplicate products in this calendar so i'm not mad at it and i'm glad it's a different scent 
Okay, door number 18. Let's see what we've got. We have got from the Rituals of Samurai a antiperspirant spray. So this is the organic bamboo and sandalwood scent. So we can smell this now because we've got a spray rather than the foaming shower gel. That's quite nice. It is, like I said, probably a bit more of a typically masculine scent, but you can wear whatever scent you want. It doesn't matter. I don't know, how, how do we feel about getting a deodorant in here? Like, I kind of really like it, but I also kind of don't. I can't decide if I'm happy with this or not. Um, so this is a 50 mil, so you'll get a good couple of use, well, a good few uses out of this, let's be fair. But let me know down below, are we excited about a deodorant? Like we got a toothpaste in the ASOS 24 day calendar and I wasn't impressed. But, but this is something, this is special for a deodorant. I'm in two minds. Let me know how you feel about this. Door number 19. Oh, this packaging is gorgeous. We've got the Rituals of Buddha Energizing Shower Scrub and this is the Sweet Orange and Cedarwood. Oh, okay. This sounds amazing. So it's a body scrub. I can smell the citrus coming through, but this isn't an overpowering one, but it's got tiny, tiny little scrubbies in it. So this is not gonna be an aggressive body scrub at all. Yeah, I can definitely smell the sandalwood coming through and a uh, the cedarwood coming through and a little bit of the orange. That's nice. Oh, I love this packaging. I love it, love it, love it. On to door number 20. We are getting to the final doors and this is, I'm just guessing, gonna be our fourth candle. What do we think about the candles, guys? It's a nice touch, but I don't know. What do we think about having four candles? So this is the Black Oud scent. I've never been the biggest fan of Black Oud, I'm not gonna lie. It's never been the scent for me. Like, I like really sweet, citrusy, fruity kind of scents. So this is a bit heavy, but I will give it a go and it looks so nice in this black packaging with the black wax but yeah i don't know how i feel about four candles i get the concept and it's a really nice concept it is a christmas advent calendar after all but i'm not sure let me know what you think door number 21 is a christmas tree and we have got the rituals of namaste glow natural skincare radiance anti-aging serum and this is in saffron flower and wild indigo so we've got a facial skincare product and this is an anti-aging serum that's amazing we've got 10 mils in here so let's give this a go oh that is a really nice scent i like that Oh goodness, yeah, that feels amazing. That's gonna be a gorgeous serum to use. And it's just sinking right into the skin. It feels really nice and hydrating. But I don't know if my hands could get any more hydrated right now, guys. So I might not be the best, <laughs> best person to tell you, but it does feel hydrating and it has just sunk right into the skin. Door number 22. Oh, wow. We've got another foaming shower gel, but this is in the Ritual of Holly. And this is Flamingo Flower and Pink Grapefruit. I'm going to love this. This packaging is gorgeous. Let's see if we can smell it. Oh, we can't, but I don't want to waste any because they you just tap it and it goes everywhere. Do you know what? Let's just do one. <laughs> That's how little you need. I love that it's purple. Wow. It's not the strongest scent. Let's see if when I like rub it into my skin a bit. <laughs> It isn't the strongest scent, but it's purple. I, yeah, I'm sold. I'm sold on the packaging and I'm sold on the color. This is the third foaming shower gel we've had. So if you're not me, that could be annoying. But for me, that's amazing. Door number 23, we are on the second to last door. And we have another foaming shower gel. This is the Rituals of Hamam, which is the fresh eucalyptus and rosemary scent. Even I'm thinking this might be too many. Is that four that we've had now? Even I'm thinking we could have had a little bit more variety, um, but it makes me happy. But if you don't like foaming shower gels, you have a lot by this point. So yeah, I don't know. It's not too many for me, guys, because I promise you I will use all of these and enjoy it. But I understand that some people are going to say that's too much. On to the final door. 
and I am concerned that it's a little Christmas tree, but it's a heavy Christmas tree. So let's see. Oh, we have a perfume. This is, I don't know what this is. What is it? It is the Rose de Shiraz Eau de Parfum. <laughs> Parfum? Parfum. <laughs> this packaging is so luxe and fancy and gorgeous. This is gonna look really nice on a surface top. Maybe not mine, because mine's very pink and, and white, but somewhere else this is gonna look really nice. Let's give this a smell. I can smell the rose, but it's not overpowering. This is so, this is my worst nightmare, guys, trying to describe a perfume to you. Oh, it's got some ingredients on the box. So it's damask rose, ambret and zesty rhubarb so that's what the scents are i like this actually this is quite different i wasn't expecting a perfume uh so this is a nice little treat for christmas eve there's no christmas day draw in this uh box unfortunately but that is a really nice product to end on so that's everything that we've got in our calendar i'm a bit in between with this i think we've got some really really nice products to try but in the grand scheme of things we could have done without four candles and we could have done without four foaming body sprays i'm happy with that but looking at it in the bigger picture we could have done with maybe some different products in there to try but maybe there's only so many products that rituals have in their scheme of products but they just have lots of different scents so i appreciate that there's different scents in all the products we don't have any two products that are the same scent so in that sense we don't have any duplicates but let me know what you think down below i think if you are a hardcore rituals fan this is for you i think if you're not into your pampering body skincare this is not the one for you. It was a lovely experience and it's beautiful. A little bit frustrating to put together, but still super fun. I can't wait to hear what you guys think on this one because I'm a little bit indifferent. I am really going to enjoy all the products that I've got, but it's not my favourite. So I can't wait to hear what you guys think. If this is the calendar for you, I'll leave the link down below. But thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.